Hello, golf mates. You join me on my own at Golf de Sur. Now, let me tell you now, I'm on my own, but I'm not on my own. But there's a big problem. If you can see that wind, it's nearly blowing the ball off the tee. Right, if you're new to the channel, welcome. I am Liam from the Golf Mates. Hello, I'm in sunny Tenerife, making loads of good golf videos for you at home. Before I said good golf videos, that might not be true. They'll be okay, do you know what I mean? They're worth a watch without a shadow of a doubt. So, I'm here in Tenerife. This is a 360 yard par four. If you've seen the video before, I've nearly drove it in the green first time I were here and uh, Mr Barlow put it in a cactus, but today this wind is vicious and I mean right, it's not doing my Barnet any good. You're coming from America, Barnet, it's her. So we're going to have a little chat, I'm going to do some shout outs, I want to thank a lot of golf mates. This one, there'll be no running zoom, I'm going to do a shot tracer for you, but I'm hoping I hit a good one. I think I'm going to aim it at Barlow's cactus down there and let it fade with the wind. Now, will you do me a favour? Wish me luck. <laughs> if I see the drinks buggy, I'll be getting a nice water. Oh, absolutely ripped one. That's nice. No wind's playing with that, no. Stay on the top. Perfect. Now, that was a, the smallest amount left to right. It's not gone down the hill, but it'd be a good look for the green. Hey, do you like my top? Nice, white, brand new shorts. Let's keep them that way, that's all I'm saying. Right, golf mates, hope. I tell you what, golf mates, this buggy, have you seen the speed of this buggy? Honestly, I, I'm not even carrying any weight. It's uh, the slowest buggy ever, but the dummy proud golf to sir. Got me on nice and quiet, but look at this. If you remember the first hole, and my first drive with Mr. Barlow, look where I am now. I mean, look at that, uh, oh God. I only can just see the green, look at this. Look at this, look at me here, uh, look at me here, uh, it's horrendous. Where's that flag? Oh my God, I don't know if you can hear me with the mic. The flag is tucked away there. Oh, Gordon Bennett. Can't believe it, I'm gonna have to do another shot tracer, but I'll have to get a club for this. Give me a minute. Oh, I do like to be beside the seaside. Oh, I do like to be beside the sea. Right, I have got 123 yards, golf mates. Are you ready? I'm going with a seven. It's just a beast. And I want to aim where I'm putting that line now because it might go that way with the wind a bit. But more importantly, there's a bunker there. I don't want to be in that bunker. And I'm close to it in a six iron. But we'll hit this. We'll hit this. Not going back now. Another shot tracer. Oh, get me a workout here with the editing. Hope you're doing all right, golf mates. Oh, that's all over it. But all the wind's taking it to the pin. Wow, I'll show you that. Can you see? Can you see that treacle? What a great strike that were. By the minor strike in the 70s, that was a proper Arthur Scargle. If you're new to the channel, Arthur Scargle was somebody who made all these miners have strikes for line his own pocket. I think they called him Two Jag Scargle, because on one jag he weren't in it because other people wanted to chuck bricks at him. Shabba! Look at this golf mate's really happy with that. Wonder where it bounced. But yeah, really, really happy with that. What's going on? Oh, the plane coming. Oh my chicken and rice. Right, I'm gonna put this, let's cover the mic. I like this, I just speed up while this plane does run. 40 minutes, Mr. Barlow and Joe are on the plane. Right, nap that way, grain that way, sun. So I think this is slow, but it will be a little bit right to left, but it'll go a bit more. And what do you reckon of that big daft putter? Am I going to keep it or not? That's good pace. That's good pace. That's good. Oh, you're going there. Oh, slow down. Slow down. Oh, chicken. Wow, I was saying it had good pace. 
I mean, it had as pace as Ben Johnson, that, didn't it? Do you remember him? Eh? Yeah, I don't know. Right. I watched that. There was a little bit of movement. Come on, that was a great tee shot and a great second shot. Do not free put. Well, technically, we're off the green, I suppose, for the rules officials. Come on. Shh. It's going to get there. Oh, he's drifting on the nap. That's the only thing with these nap was when they lose pace, that's what happens. Well, it's stroke free. I don't even know what we're playing. I don't know what we're playing. We'll play summer. I've got an idea. We'll have a game of golf. Yes. And uh, we'll play somewhere like on the next holes. I'll give you yardages and stuff like that. And we'll play, what will do it? Yeah, what will do it? Can you do better than Liam? This is a tricky old golf, mates. It is 123 yards. The wind, found a tee, look at that. The wind is left to right, very strong. I did fancy pitching wedge, but I'm going off a video I did, just in case I'm not playing well. I've gone with a nine, and what would you, what would you hit, 125 yards? This hole is dedicated to Peter Lund. Peter, this is for you, our kid. Nice lad, Peter. He's far stink, but he's a nice lad. So what would you do, golf mates? Wind left to right. I'm just seeing the pins up front, back of it, it could roll back. It's not gonna go super. Super, super John, super, super John, super, super John, super John making the... Right, so I've got a little nine. Oh, that's gorgeous, that. Right, you've seen the shot tracer. It looked great, didn't it? Let me zoom in, see it? Short like my little willy on a cold winter's day. Right, as you've just seen there, it weren't the best strike. It's a bit short. I just didn't hit it. But, but, it doesn't matter. Do you know what I mean? No one's died. I can get that up and down, no problem. Magic is in the hands, and I've got magic hands. Trust me, just be a decorator. Is this the way to Amarillo? Right, golf mates, not a great shot. Short, that's gone about 115 yards. Have to chip it because this is coarse grass and uh, it, they just don't bump and run. Got to get it on the green with a little bit of check because that will be fast. Come on, this is for you, Peter. I dedicated it for you. Peter Lund, my Yorkshire mate from Northumberland. Ish. No bite. Oh, it's gone in. Oh! Ah, yeah. Chicken and rice. Uh, listen, it was juicy, wasn't it? No, we had this yesterday. Okay, nope, didn't deserve going. If this thing were, I'll be zooming in later, I'll show you. In fact, I won't, you've seen it anyway. Right, okay, I've got that for a par. Mmm, it was tasty, wasn't it? Do you know what I mean? It was like a big steak with salt and pepper. Or if you're a fish man, Bit of cod. Right. Now that is left to right, but because the nap's going that way, I'm tempted to aim straight. I'm gonna aim straight, yes. This is straight. Because the nap will cancel out the finger jig. And it I did, it did. Right, a par. Peter Lund, that's for you. Right, who's the next golf mates next hole? What would you have done there, golf mates? What would you have took off the tee? I'd chip with a gap wedge, which is, I think is about 50. Not 50 pound, 50 degree. Got a par, got a par. Right, golf mates, here we are on a par five. And it, it's a great tee shot here when I were here over there. We think it's only about 470, 480. But you don't want to be right, you need to be left, especially with the wind going this way. What would you do? For this one, Dean Callard. This all's for you, pal. You've been commenting for a long time. I've just whipped the comments out and had a look at your comments, you know what I mean? Uh, if Pat Ray now, he'd be saying there's some nice ladies over there. I'm happily married, but there is. So, what would you have, golf mates? It's 160 just to get to the front of the fairway there, because get over the pond. I think it's this all day. No problem, no drama. Definitely want to be aiming left, because that wind's vicious. Nice floaty cut into wind, as they say. Oh, yes. Go on then. Shot tracer's got to have that in this light. My tea's gone backwards. Proper Paula Creamer on the tea. She's a beautiful woman, this. Right, golf mates. I got unlucky there, really. Like I said, we're left to right. Down here, there would have been, what, 
10 foot more left, I would have, I would have gained 30 yards, but I would have had a blind tee shot, a uh, blind tee shot, blind second shot, right. It's 228 yards. It's one of them, if you hit the fairway, you might get a little bounce. The wind though is into and left to right. Now I'm thinking free wood, aim at them houses, because I'm good at that. And the wind will blow it that way if I have that slice, or if you hit a belter, it should be all right. Now what would you do? Golf mate on there from Scotland, from Dundee. Right, back. Shout out for Stu McIntosh from Dundee, my utility friend. Right, I've got free wood. What would you do, golf mate? I'm just going to give this a whack because, well, I am. I think really. Slightly uphill. Lie. So that should be. Yeah, this. I'm hitting this. Right, I might shot trace for it. I might zoom. Depends how I hit it. That was a horrible swing. I think you might see it bouncing. I think it's in front of that black bunker-ish. It's very hard to see it's sunny here. No, I won't lie to you there, golf mates. What did I do then? No. Right, golf mates, was it the shot? I didn't hit it great, but if I did, you've got these bunkers here. Maybe a seven iron and a full wedge in because I've got a 60 here now. I'm going to have to hit it hard and it needs a bit of check because I keep saying it, these sort of courses, that nap is all that way, sea dropping, see there so i need to drop this a little bit short but with a bit of jizz so even just on the green here is a good shot and i mean that it's not easy let's clip it there that could be beautiful no it bites i mean i, I could play that any better can't play that any better can't play that any better and it's rolled and it's still rolling Wow. Honestly, right, you've seen that. I played that awesome. It checked up and I waited and I had a shot. I ran, zoomed, and it was still moving. So I know I'm going to have a slow putt, but you might hear a play in a minute. Mr. Barlow and Joe are on it. Hey, now you're going to laugh, golf mates, and you'll be thinking, Liam, that's not a great shot. Honestly, I'm feeling these 60 degree wedges banging them in. I'm loving it. You just can't do it back home. Are you looking at my derry are there? This is the way to Amarillo. One windy course or this, it is windy. Oh, it's viciously uphill, this. Yeah, this is gonna need a whack. This is where I need that big putter. See, I'm concentrating now, because it's for a birdie, but I just want a par. Right, I'll give that a whack. I'll give that a whack. Is it inside the circle of friendship? Is it in, is it in, is it in? I'm only playing me, I might as well have that. Don't be daft, I've got to put that in. The police will be on me then. You cannot have that, Liam. Did I tell you I could speak German? Oh, I can. What is your name? Eh? I'm only saying that because I seen Grandad on Only Fools and Horses last night. That was a funny episode, that. Right, this might hit the flag and come out, but it is in because the thing's hard. Nope, I bogeyed that. That didn't hit the thing. I tell you what, I still think I'm better with that big putter. That's too over gross, I can't believe that. Decent drive, a bit of a weird second one. Great chip, good first putt. I don't know. Anyway, I've been Liam Harrison. Nice video for you. Hope you're doing well. Hope you're keeping safe. More importantly, hope you're keeping sane. And I mean that, golf mates. Big up to you, big respect for watching the channel, big respect for everything. My heart bleeds for you not playing golf, it really does. I'll do my best for you. And honestly, hand on heart, thanks for watching the channel and uh, keep good golf, mates, keep good. Video de dedicated to, I shout him out a lot, but he does a lot of things for me and I love him to bits. This video is dedicated to Joe Perez. See you tomorrow, golf mates. Oh, golf mates, can you like the video? It really helps. Honestly, every time I ask you, do it. And it's, it's, it's crazy. Golf mates.